All right, here we go. So I was talking to Joe Sam Bowie, cousin Joe Sam Bowie again today. And we got to talking and we had a great talk and uh, talking about things we did when we were little. <clears throat> anyway, I, it made me think of a time that mom and dad took us to Colorado when I was little. So I was probably five or six years old. And, you know, Clifford probably wasn't even born yet. So it's probably just me and Carl. Now here's a picture. I don't know if I can hold this up at all to get it in here. Oh yeah, it's not bad. Picture of dad and me. It's got a big split down the middle because it's folded, but it's my picture now. Anyway, that's me aiming a gun at the camera with my cowboy hat on. Dad holding Carl. But that's Dad back in, uh, what's it, 1959. So I was born in 54. So this is about the time Mom and Dad took us to Colorado on this trip I'm thinking about. Here's another picture of Dad on one of his motorcycles. This double reverse thing is so hard to hold up. But there's Dad in the backyard on Loch Lomond, one of his motorcycles. So my dad was a... Uh, Golden Gloves boxer and he lifted weights. He was in the army. He was a military policeman in the army in Yokohama, Japan, where I was born. And so he's a pretty tough dude. And anyway, <clears throat> we go fishing in Colorado. So, you know, we're from Waco, Texas, and we go up there and we're, it's just me and dad. And I bet it was, you know, I bet I was five or six years old. I was a little bitty kid. And so we're fishing in this little bitty creek in Colorado. And I'm like, what are we doing fishing here? This creek's like six feet wide. And it's just running, making a lot of noise, bubbling. And so we got these big old uh, Eagle Claw gold crappie hooks, you know. <laughs> and I'm not sure what we have for bait. I'm sorry my nose itches. I just got out of the shower. But... Uh, I don't know what we have for bait. Maybe we're using worms or trying to find grasshoppers or something, but we weren't catching anything. And I'm sure I had my little Zebco 202 with a big old gold eagle claw crappie hook on it. <clears throat> and I'm with my big daddy, you know, and we're up there in the woods and we're fishing. And this guy up above us, uh, you know, he's, he's just hammering the fish, man. He's catching them one after another. And they're just little old six or seven inch trout but he's catching a bunch of them and so dad says what are you catching them on he says ham and eggs and dad looked down at me he said what did he say i said dad sound like he said ham and eggs to me dad said what what are you catching them on and i said ham and eggs and dad <laughs> he looks at me again like what what is it? i said all I heard was ham and eggs again, Dad. And so I thought my daddy was going to go up there and, you know, like, hold my rod, boy. <laughs> I thought he was going to go up there and throw that guy in the creek because he was making fun of us because for some reason he might have been able to find, you know, decide or discern that we were not from Colorado when we were like, hey, how are y'all doing? And so <laughs> I thought Dad was going to go up there and drown this guy in the creek. And Dad, the third time, says, what did you say? What are you catching them on? And the guy says, salmon eggs. And we went, salmon? What? You know, and we're right. <laughs> so anyway, we did, dad didn't throw him in the creek. So we went to town and bought some salmon eggs. We, we said salmon. And uh, I mean, I was raised in uh, Robinson, Texas and Waco, Texas. And our teachers told us, taught us how to say Spokane Washington because it's got one N, so that makes it a long A. Helena, Montana, because it's got one L, that makes it a long E, Helena. And so we never heard the word salmon in our lives. We said salmon. We're gonna go buy some salmon and, and barbecue it. We didn't do that really, but we always said salmon. So when this guy said salmon eggs, all we heard was ham and eggs. Anyway, we went to town and bought some ham and eggs in a little bitty little bitty jar and came back up there and I put two salmon eggs on my big gold eagle claw crappie hook and threw it in this little pool biggest pool I could find and about a 10 inch trout came out you know and he he looked at it and sucked it in his mouth 
And I said, Kirk, that's a sign. He's got it in his mouth. It's gone. Said to he spit it back out. I was like, oh, no. We weren't used to being able to see into the water. You know, the visibility in Lake Waco is about, you know, nine inches. It's all muddy. Got five creeks coming into it. So anyway, get you some salmon eggs. Have fun. Life is good. And uh, be sure you take care of your friends and family. And... <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just I'm I'm laughing about something else. But um take care of your friends and family. Subscribe to my little YouTube channel, please. And uh life's good. I'm gonna try to shut this thing off here. Uh all right, everybody have fun. Adios.